Hey there friends, I've been getting a ton of food cravings lately, so I wanted to share with you my current seven favorite go-to treats that I've been including into my calorie window so I can have my treats and stay on track and keep leaning out the way I would like to to get fit Whoa. for summer. <laughs> I like your mom 90 jeans. Thanks. Oh yeah, mom cargo jeans. Size small. Whoa. I have been getting a ton of cravings and often I'll have pretty much I've had most of my food for the day. So what's cool with these is they're 150 calories or less what I'm going to show you. So they can be added on to my meals and still fit in my calorie window so I can still stay in my calorie deficit. The other cool thing about the majority of these treats that I'm going to show you is that they can be added to plain foods to spice them up like yogurt, French toast, oatmeal, cottage cheese, and it will make them taste so much better and you'll look forward to your food so much more. So let's start with the first one. Cookies, chocolate chip cookies is like a big craving of mine lately. And I found these Dare cookie chips at my local grocery store. You can have six of these for 140 calories and they're a great size. And what's cool is like, they can be crumbled into yogurt, they can be crumbled into low calorie ice cream, top it with fat-free Cool Whip, but that's quite a decent size and they satisfy my chocolate chip cookie craving. The next thing that I found, and I had no clue, I, I love marshmallows, but I steered clear of them because I didn't think they were as low fat and low calorie. I discovered a tip too, if you get the multicolored marshmallows, the mini ones, they are lower in sugar than the regular white mini marshmallows. Oh, I didn't know that either. Um, because when I looked, the white ones were like 20, almost 20 grams of sugar for the same amount, and these ones are only 13. So two thirds of a cup of mini marshmallows is 100 calories and no fat. That's actually a lot for 100 calories. That's huge. Imagine like how much better your plain yogurt or your oatmeal will taste if you throw that on top. Oh. Heaven, look how much you get. Seriously, like isn't that crazy? And the mini marshmallow, like the multicolor, some of them actually are fruity flavors like this one. Four fun fruity flavors. And they're actually, they actually do taste different. Like usually, you know, when you grow up as a kid and you see all the different colors and sometimes the candy or whatever tastes the same. The same, yeah. These actually have different flavors. I was like, I, I bought two bags because I was like, this is amazing. <laughs> so we put these on, that's actually a great idea, especially combined with um, what's coming up in the next snacks to put on like oatmeal or something. But we put them on our anabolic ice cream, this kind of stuff and it's great. Actually, all of the, most of these we add to our anabolic ice cream as well, but we also eat them separate. Like the next thing I eat just, I'll just eat it for a snack, but I like topping yogurt or an, low calorie or anabolic ice cream with this kids cereal. Who knew it? If you get the kids cereal, it's like low in calorie, low in fat, and you get quite a bit. And I'm showing you two different options here. The first one is the French Toast Crunch. For 33 grams, which is three quarters of a cup, it's 130 calories and one and a half grams of fat. And not only do Kyle and I look for low calorie stuff, we look for lower fat, because often you can eat a lot more food for lower fat and lower calories. That's the funny thing, until we looked for ourselves, we were listening to like marketing yeah. for the so-called healthy harvest adult cereals. They're way more calories than the kids cereal. And a lot of people say that they're not healthy, but look, they're made with whole grains and they're not really that big in sugar. 10 grams of sugar for that, it's, it satisfies my craving. I can add it to a plain meal and it makes it so delicious. And then Oreo O's, which is amazing. You get more of the Oreo O's. You get one cup or 31 grams for 120 calories. And keep in mind, we're not saying that your diet should consist of these. No, these are things that we add 
to help with our cravings. Me and Nicole eat a ton of spinach, fruit, fruit veggies. veggies. So don't get it twisted. These are to add as a you know a cool flavor topping yes or to spice up your you know french toast or your yogurt or cottage cheese we add these as treats to keep us on track and every once in a while we give ourselves the real thing but most of the time if we have a craving we choose one of these things and it keeps us loving our food and like kyle said the majority of our diet is a lot of fruit veggie and lean protein and we eat also carbs for fuel and for muscle building. We keep in mind a balance, right? All the yes. time. This is how me and Nicole have been able to keep off a hundred plus pounds for six years. Yeah. Because we've realized it's, I love it. you gotta love your food, but it's the calories in calories out. So weight actually was affecting our health more yeah. than worrying about chemicals or kids cereals or that kind of stuff. Yeah. And by having these treats on hand, we eat healthy the majority of the day, and then if we have a craving or we want a sweet treat, we can add these in because we give ourselves a calorie window. Mine is 17 to 1900 calories, and I usually go on the higher end, the 1900, because I'm very active. And having these treats allows me, like Kyle said, we have lost 130 pounds each, and we've kept it off for six years because we love our food, and we also have little treats like this. We see so many people go through the same problems we did when we were yo-yo dieting. Yeah. It was take away all treats, Everything. take away flavor, take away salt, take away sugar. We did it. <laughs> then they fall off track. And then it's back to, I'm gonna be a perfect eater with just broccoli and chicken and rice. And then they fall off track. Again. And we did, we did all of that. We made multiple mistakes. Then we realized if we have stuffed tasty things like this on hand that are low calorie, so we can fit it into our calorie deficit every day, we look forward to our food like I jump out of bed, so does Kyle, and we look forward to our food all day. So let's move on to the next one, which this graham crackers. I did not realize that these are actually pretty low calorie and you get quite a bit. So you get two sheets of graham crackers. This is 31 grams for 130 calories and three grams of fat. And it's eight grams of sugar. And for 130, if you wanted to go at the 150 mark, Add a tablespoon of this no sugar added strawberry jam on top, which makes them taste extra delicious. It's another 20 calories. So that's a really tasty snack for 150 calories. I love putting this in my Greek yogurt. If you guys watched our breakfast prep that we just put out, it makes it really tasty. And if you wanna be a little fancier and break that 150 calorie, you could do powdered peanut butter, like some PB2 or something and make yeah. peanut butter and jam, graham it, crackers. Exactly, you can make mini peanut butter and jam sandwiches. The next one, chocolate. And like, we get asked about cravings all the time, which is also why we wanted to do this video. I get a ton of chocolate cravings. Mini chocolate chips I discovered are amazing because they're so small, it feels like you get so much more. So these mini chocolate chips, you get two tablespoons or 30 grams for 140 calories. And look at how much you get. Can you imagine sprinkling, put those in your oatmeal or your Greek yogurt, how much better that would taste? So even if you did like, that's what I was talking about with the marshmallows, you did like even a little bit, like a uh, couple teaspoons of those and a couple of these, how much better would that make your plain oatmeal? Or you could take a little bit of marshmallow, a little bit of the graham cracker, and a little bit of this Whoa. to make 150 calories and have a little s'more, right? So you can play around with these and make them your own. I like to always have a little s'more. A little s'more. That was cute. <laughs> okay, major craving alert. I have been craving popsicles. So I went to the store and I looked around until I found some really cool low calorie ones. So these are just the popsicle brand Tropical Paradise. And it comes in mango, pineapple, island punch, and strawberry banana, which all sound amazing. And two of them, 140 calories. And I, after we're done this video, like I'm probably gonna eat these. <laughs> You know what I just learned right now, what and I'm 40 years old. What did you learn? Popsicle is a brand. I thought yeah. that was just like what they were called. I didn't know Popsicle was an actual brand. No, it's an actual brand. Like you remember Popsicle Pete when we were little, like on the Popsicle packages? No. Yeah, it's a brand. But but then they just get called Popsicle. Everyone just calls them Popsicles. It's like Kleenex. Everyone calls every tissue yeah. Kleenex, I but Kleenex, Kleenex is a brand. 
I call it clings. Do you guys call them popsicles or do you call them ice pops? Let us know down below because I always call them popsicles, but if you look on the boxes, they say like ice pop I, or I, fruit pop or I whatever. I don't think you're telling the truth. I think that Popsicle Pete was like your imaginary friend. No, okay, guys, please save me here. Tell him about Popsicle Pete. No one if, remembers Popsicle Pete because he didn't exist. Guys, if you were born in the 80s and you know about Popsicle Pete, will you please tell Sassman about Popsicle Pete? Okay? <laughs> Seriously. And then, we're gonna throw in a bonus because this you this is so versatile. So this is just unsweetened applesauce. It is super tasty. Three of these. Okay, look at this. Three of these is 150 calories. You can eat three of these. Yeah, people are so afraid of fructose and fruit. Now, Dude. obviously, whole fruit is better for you, but right. where we were at when we were starting out, and sometimes now we just want applesauce or something quick and easy. You can bring these with you if you're going out shopping or camping or whatever, you can bring them with you. This is really good. Any portable snack was really good for us in the beginning and we still like it now because if you're going grocery shopping and you're starving, which we used to go hungry, if you eat something like this, it'll tide you over and you're less likely to grab stuff you didn't want to grab in the grocery store or less likely to stop at fast food if you didn't intend to because you have some of these in your car or in your desk at work or whatever. And these make, when you're cooking with protein powder, it can get really dry. If you add applesauce in, it actually makes it more moist. So a snack, an add, you can put it on graham crackers. You can add it to oatmeal, or actually sometimes I have added it to my Greek yogurt. You can do a lot with that. You know that. what I used to do with these? And not even a whole one actually, I used to have like, Peanut butter and toast was my breakfast, and I used to put a couple tablespoons of applesauce, uh, no sugar added, on my toast with peanut butter. Yeah, that's really good, actually. And you know what else we used to do was get the plain rice cakes and put the applesauce on top. Oh, I and forgot put about that. And a sprinkle of cinnamon. Oh. We used to do that for post-workout. Remember when we no, were first starting? No, because I'm 40 and I'm losing <laughs> my mind. Well, we used to do that, and it actually makes the rice cakes taste like delicioso. How do you do that? <laughs> okay, so the friends. That is it. If you want to know exactly how Kyle and I lost our first and next 50 pounds, check out, we have two weight loss guides down below. Exact meal plans, exact portions, family friendly recipes, everything down there that you need. Check, or you can check out these videos for free. One, two. And don't forget to like, share, subscribe. The more the merrier, the more we can get our message out there that you can love your food, you can lose weight, you can love your life and do it the better. So let's lawn more in a bar cup and shake it till your mama made it and and hula hoop and hula hoop and who needs a hula hoop and go. That might be too romantic for YouTube. Well, I didn't do the shake your bean because YouTube might not like that. So, so hula hoop without a hula hoop it is. And we have these llama slippers. Llamas eat the cereal. <laughs> oh, we love you guys. Just love ya. Thanks for your support. We love you. Thanks for watching. Peace it out. That was like a curtain. Bye, guys. Goodbye. It's time for your meds. I need those popsicles now. Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Fight through it. You can do it. Don't give up.